SiliconAngle.com and Wikibon's flagship telecast, The Cube. We go out to the event, extract the signal from the noise. I'm John Furrier, I'm joined with my co-host. I'm Dave Vellante of Wikibon.org, and we're here with a special guest, Gina Blaber of O'Reilly Media. Gina, thanks very much. Thank you, good Appreci to be here. Appreciate you coming back on The Cube. Welcome back. Thank you. So we were talking off camera about the amazing growth yeah. of uh, the Stratacomp and, and, and plus the Dupe world. Just yeah. it's really been phenomenal. We, yeah. we were here in the early days, and you know, it was a fun little gathering, yeah. and now yeah. it's really you know, getting amazingly real. <laughs> well, it's grown huge, just even comparing last year's numbers to this year's. I mean, it's just really taken off, and you can see that that's a lot of, so a lot of that is that there's the awareness of big data these, mm -hmm. these days in business and in organizations and government, but also New York is such a happening place for data. I mean, this is, you know, Bloomberg is all about data, so it's, it's yeah, perfect. Yeah, and, and beyond here. the numbers, this, the substance of the conversation is changing, too. Um, mm -hmm. You're hearing just a lot more real-world examples, and and practical examples as opposed to science projects, don't you think? Yeah, well we had Mike Flowers today um, mm. from the city um, and he was talking about some very practical ways that the city is literally using data in a whole bunch of um, ways to save lives. And to prioritize where right. the fire people should right. go. I mean, right. That's an amazing story. So, yep. so um, talk about more about the uh, the vision that you guys have for this, for this event. You're really expanding, you just did you know, <laughs> Strata yeah. Rx. I mean, it's yeah. really becoming a, 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 a much more um, substantial yeah. worldwide yeah. Uh, and the roles of people that are attending are expanding as well. Right, well we just did a Strata event in London, which was our first one a couple of weeks ago. Um, then we did a Strata RX event mm. last week in San Francisco. Um, and that was a really interesting one. That was our first Strata event focused on the healthcare space. And um, we didn't know what to expect. It was our first event and it was really impressive. The, uh, it was just a wide range of people, some from the medical industry, some from the technology space, some from the quantified self space, some from sort of a lot of the, the areas where those um, places intersect. And just a, a huge amount of excitement about the ways that data can transform the healthcare space. That's a very, uh, sort of, I want to say stodgy uh, industry in a lot of ways, and um, but there are, there's a huge amount of game-changing stuff that's happening from within and outside of the healthcare yeah, industry. Yeah, well, historically, they've not been big adopters of information technology. They certainly adopt, yeah. spend a lot of money on medical devices, but yeah. not, uh, not IT, and now we're seeing examples. I know I read several coming out of the, the RX conference where it's not only cutting costs, but it's saving lives. Yes, and Gene, that's what they're most interested in. Gene, I know you're really busy, and we really appreciate you coming on theCUBE, so uh, thanks for coming on, but I want to ask a couple questions real quick sure. before before we break in uh, our next segment is, O'Reilly's um, an integrated media company that works on stuff that matters. That's what yeah. Maureen and I talk about. I don't know if, that, I don't know if that's the official slogan, but uh, we'd li that's what she said, and, and we like it. Uh, Silicon Angle has that same mindset of free content yeah. and, and creating awareness. So I want to get your perspective of the crowdsourcing movement, because uh, you know, free information creates more community. Yeah. Talk about the O'Reilly philosophy, because you guys run such a big event. Strata was a bold move, it was a first of its kind, mm -hmm. but in the O'Reilly mindset, it was kind of pioneering new ground. It was kind of business and big data, and you got now more verticals. What's the vision of Strata going forward and O'Reilly's perspective around that? You know, a lot of the vision has to do with um, what we do, which is listening to the alpha geeks. So we're talking constantly to people who are probably not very well known, even even in many ways in these conferences, because we're talking to people who are doing cutting edge stuff. A lot of them are doing little startups, or they're in somebody's basement, or they're bur you know buried in some large com uh, company and nobody knows really what they're doing. So we're talking to those people, um, and they're not all guys, um, and we're looking for the faint signals about what's really important that's happening in, in the world of Strata, you know, around data. And uh, we basically do books and conferences that are not about, well, gee, where, would, where do we think we're going to make the most money, but where do we think there's something that's actually going to be game changing? So with RX, yeah. you know, around healthcare, where, where are we going to make a big difference? Tim, Tim always says, I'm a trend spotter, you yeah. know, and that's cool, but you guys have some cool hands-on stuff. You got the data sensing thing here. Yes. Talk about some of the hands-on things that O'Reilly does. A lot of people might not know about you. You have good, you know, intimate events, but you're also doing a lot of geeky, you know, the Maker Fair kind of concepts. Yes. You guys are, you guys are tinkering as well. I yeah. mean, you're playing around. This yeah. data sensing thing is, is it's really it's bizarre fun. And, and fun and good. And we don't know how it's going to turn out. So, yeah. you know, it could be a flop or we could come up with some interesting data that people will find useful here at the conference and also outside. Oh, well, we're doing the startup showcase. We did that last night. So that's yeah. a bunch of people, you know, startups demoing their stuff. We've got um, Ignite, which of course happened on Monday night. 
I mean, we're trying to find ways at the conference and outside for, peop for different people in different parts of the community to get their voice heard. So some yeah. of it's actually presenting at conference, but there are a lot of other formats uh, as well. And you said community, that's the key word. Yeah. Understanding the community and feeding the community. Yeah. A lot of different things now. It's not just a physical event, it's a lot of other elements. So one thing that we did related to that, um, we're uh, part of a, a event that's happening this, year, uh, with this week called New York City Data Week. So we collaborated with the city of New York, um, specifically with the uh, Department of Information Technology and Telecommunications, known as DOIT, um, to put on this thing called uh, New York City Data Week, and we actually got a um, proclamation from the mayor's office declaring this uh, to be Data Week in New York. Um, so there are some 40 or so events that are happening in and around um, New York. Uh, some of them are happening here at the hotel, but a lot of them are happening um, in people in different offices and at meetups that are basically celebrating um, data in various organizations and um, gatherings. So uh, we awesome. hope you do that next year as well. Well, thanks for having us here at theCUBE. We love broadcasting uh, your events. They're authoritative. It's great, rich content. Uh, you guys do a fantastic job. We love Maureen, and uh, <laughs> we hope to have Tim on. And But I think yes. Tim might come on. We got to get him in here tomorrow. Got to catch him. Got to get Maureen <laughs> rolling her eyes. <laughs> Tim will see the lights. I know he'll come in. We're going to get Tim. I'm going to see him. We'll, we'll wrestle That's him in. Uh, O'Reilly Media, great firm, integrated media company, working on things that matter. Um, if you know them, they're great. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. We'll be right back with our next guest after this short break. Thanks very much.